What is going on everyone? Kyle here. Welcome back to another video. Uh, playing Forza Horizon 2 once again. Enjoying the shit out of this game. Loving this game so much. Um, it's looking as good as new. I tell you, this car is really something. A shame it's been so long just wasting away. Come and get it. We actually have a Ferrari GTO available now, so that's awesome. But uh, we actually headed to this event right here. This is the third uh, event, the East Wall Scramble for the Retro uh, Hot Hatch series. Uh, we have this one and one more uh, event to do, so we're going to be doing those. And then maybe we'll check out some uh, barn finds as well. Event three of four, scramble. I don't know how. I don't know what kind of voice that was. Just like my uh, evil movie guy voice, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Ready. It's raining. Oh man. Even more acceleration power in the rain with this. No, I'm just kidding. Just kidding. All right, let's go, boys. Chasing the dream. Become the Horizon Champion. And this is not how you do that. All these cars just passing me like it's nothing. I'm in last. I didn't know I was in last. That's it. Beast mode engaged. Let's go. Right on your ass, dude. I kind of just want to spin him out to be a dick, but I won't. <laughs> Oh, look, the same car. I actually like the red with the yellow on that car design. It looks pretty cool. Oh, he was right there. Shouldn't have turned over. Should have just did this. Picking them off, picking them off. One by one. Oh, shit, we got three laps. No, really, no need to rush, really. Just... I'd like to pass people as fast as possible because that's racing. And I went into the wall, or that car, really hard. Slingshot. Why are you on the brakes, dude? Oh, I'm gonna get sandwiched. Sandwiched! I could go for a sandwich right now. I'm getting kind of hungry, actually. Let's do this! Oh, I saw that last second. There's nothing I could do. Luckily, it didn't affect us that much. Just roasting the tires around that corner. I still really like the gauges in this car. It looks awesome. I, l I love the green. Taking the inside. Why do I have to crash into everyone? Why am I so bad? Hey, look, that was a good corner, actually. Oh, wow, we're on lap three of three already. That was quick. Is my car getting all muddy? No, but it's getting trashed. Take a wide approach to this. Yeah, that's how you do it, kind of. If I wouldn't have lost so much speed right there, that would have been pretty perfect, but I lost a lot of speed on that really sharp hairpin corner just because I was sliding so much. Key to front wheel drive cars is to not spin your tires. That way you have uh, all your all right, horsepower going to the win. ground. Rather than becoming wasted and yeah, just becoming wasted when you spin t your tires. Another 10 G. I get a bunch of money now because I got that 220,000 wheel spin and then a bunch, bunch more money and now I'm getting more money. And I just have so much money! Not really, I could have a lot more. I'd like a lot more. That way I can do some more, uh, 
some more drift builds and not run out of money. I was gonna be build. I was gonna build a uh, BMW M3 last night, but I ran out after I got to like the drive train. I only had like 70 credits, so that got put on hold. All right, we will do this last hot hatch event, and then we'll go find a barn car. And then, yeah, that's what we'll do. We'll go, we'll go see our barn cars because I haven't driven the uh, the van yet either. So we have the Ferrari GTO and the the hippie van, bruh, to uh, to drive. Oh no, my controller batteries are low. Hopefully we can make it to the event before they die. Take a little shortcut. Oh, excuse me, just tearing up your garden fenced in area. You have arrived at your Do a little burnout while we're sliding. Alright. While the skill chain is uh, getting done. Okay, there we go. I was gonna plug in my controller. If I can get the cord. Okay. Oh, why is it saying my controller is disconnected? Why does it do this every time I plug in my controller? Now I'm gonna have to exit the game and everything. Seriously, it always does this. I don't understand. It's like not disconnected. Now it's not gonna work at all. Shit pisses me off. Alright guys, I'm back. Um... That was ridiculous. Uh, I actually had to shut my Xbox down once again. Um, don't really know why that happens uh, per se. Just the, the fact that my controller has a low battery, and then I go to plug it into my—I um, have the—I do have the plane charge kit or whatever. So um, I have the, the USB cable plugged into my console, obviously. And when I plug it in, it says the controller has been disconnected and doesn't let me do anything. The controller does not work. Um, I have another controller. That one also will not work, even when you turn it on. So uh, the only option is a shutdown. It's really frustrating. I don't really understand it. But um, either way, we're back in this race event, and this is the last one, I believe. So we'll get this done, hopefully with a win, and then we'll win the championship and move on. Uh, I don't know why I'm trying to drift this thing not the uh, driving style for this type of car. You really don't want to use the e-brake like at all with this. It's more about trying to stay smooth and consistent rather than sloppy with a lot of wheel spin and e-brake action like you would drive your, your rear wheel drive cars. I mean you don't want to drive them slo any car sloppy but usually when you're drifting uh, you're you can be precise in drifting, but uh, sometimes it, it does get sloppy, kind of like with anything really. You have good times, you have bad times when you're driving, and um, just try to limit those bad times or bad mistakes. Learn from your mistakes and then just progress and get better. That's why um, I was actually playing with a, a guy last night who said he wasn't that great at drifting. And Basically, all I said was, um, yeah, it's no big deal, dude. You just gotta practice. So, uh, practice makes perfect. With that's that goes with for everything. I mean, from riding a bike to playing basketball to playing video games and actually getting good at video games. It actually does take practice to to become good at drifting in, in a video game and driving and uh, racing clean. Obviously, I, I haven't perfected that, and I need to practice that more. Uh, I, I know that, and uh, I just have a hard time with that, just because uh, even with the like um, braking line, it's still hard for me to judge how fast I should be going into a corner, because it's uh, 
it's a video game. I'm looking at a screen. I, I can't really like get a feel for how fast I should be going around corners. I mean, I can, but it's just a lot harder than if I were to be doing this in real life. It just takes time, like everything. Why did I bring that up? I don't really know. I gotta go back down to third though. Fourth is not the option for going up that hill. That is for sure. Especially in this. Ultimate clean racing. That light post just disappeared. Did anyone see that? Maybe it wasn't a light post. Maybe it's just a check uh, checkpoint marker or whatever. I was gonna go around the the, uh, the grass and actually go in the tar, but why? Why, should, why would you do that? There's really no point. Just to say, oh yeah, I stayed on the track the whole time. Well, there's no need to do that because there's no limits unless there's a checkpoint. And basically, you could do the whole race uh, however you wanted to as long as you make it through the checkpoints. That's my philosophy. Like this. Screw the tar. I probably saved two seconds right there. Maybe not two seconds. Maybe a second and a half. Because that makes so much of a difference, which it actually does in racing. Taking the apex of the corners. Even, actually, kind of cutting the apex of the corners. Get that little wreckage bonus. I thought I was gonna miss that one for a second. See, you can just go so much faster if you don't use the road because you don't need to use your brakes. Tapped out. I was going to try to hit that in fourth, but I didn't know how well it would have worked out, so dropped down in a third. There it is, boys! Nice championship. Another 20 points. And a championship, not just another 20 points. Yes, another championship down. Yeah, yeah. We're closing in on that spot in the finale. What do we got, 10 more to go? Yep. Oh, nine more, nice. And 15k, almost 16k. Another level up, wheel spin, yes. Holy shit, we almost leveled up completely. Got a little AR12 uh, club member right there. Still haven't made a club yet. That championship was the last of this road trip. If you're ready, let's meet up at the San Giovanni Hub, and then we'll all head back to the festival for the awards party. I actually really need to uh, make a um, club badly. I just can't think of a name. I don't know what a good name You've would be. Up. We've leveled up. Yeah. All right. Giggity, giggity. All right. That was a terrible quagmire. <laughs> terrible. We're actually gonna go find this other uh, barn find while we're right here. We might as well, right? I mean, it's right there, so. Go check it out, see what it is. I have a feeling it's up here, but that's just me. Oh, I figured you could go through that, but I guess not. Oh, you know what, guys? I can now soup this thing up. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. All right. Okay, what do we got? Got a building over there. Doesn't really look like the, uh, the type of one to have a barn car, though. See if we can see anything down here. Oh, 
I'm not really seeing anything. We'll go check up here for shits and giggles, but I highly doubt it's going to be uh, the right thing we're looking for. They don't really look like those type of buildings, but you never know. It might be near it. Or you might find a uh, 7500 XP sign and get a spin wheel, wheel spin for it. I don't know why I want to call them wheel, uh, spin wheels. Oh, always skipping past the cars. It kills me. We'll take the money, though. I'm not going to complain that much. Oh, is that another sign? Uh, nope, it's just a billboard type sign. Oh, I thought I saw a house over there. It might look like it. Kind of looks like one that may be a barn find. No, never mind. These can actually be really challenging to find sometimes. Not seeing anything. I've actually never been right here, I don't think. Maybe I have, I just don't recognize it. Take, take a little tour around the outside of this uh, circle to see if we can find anything. Oh, found another 7,500 though. Rock on. I feel like it's on the bottom side of this hill. Where I didn't look. Well, I kind of looked, but it was just like... Briefly looking like this. And it's gonna get night again, obviously. Part of me feels like it's around here. Maybe not, though. Oh. Right into the tree. <laughs> Come on, little Karata. You can do it. Not seeing anything. It's probably at the top of this hill. I guess you can't go that way. Oh man, this could get challenging. We might be going for a ride, boys. Ah, we're right on the cliff. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh no! We just died. Honestly, don't know, have any clue where this thing is. Why are these everywhere? I don't want to, I just want to go up there. Is 
things are so hard to find. Part of me feels like it's on the other side of that road, but... Oh, I think it's right there, actually. Yes, sir. That's gotta be it. Oh, yeah. What, what? What's that? Four found now? Four out of five? Three out of five? I can't remember. We oh, shit. Four out of ten. This is insane. Let's do it. Awesome. Oh, it's a Jeep. Yes, the Willys. Oh, I'm excited to drive that. Is that a U.S. Army Jeep? Jeez, this must have been here since the war. It's Army surplus at this point. Hmm, that's awesome. I'm excited for that. I'll get this ready to drive. In fact, cool. I'll make it a nice showpiece. Oh, Give me a thanks. Ready to collect. All right, let's head back to the hub and we can check out our uh, other barn cars and we can uh, do that road trip. Actually, we're gonna head to this bucket list event first, just because we're in this area. And before we leave, we might as well do it if we don't die in the woods first. There's a dot in front of me. Oh, it's another racer, I guess. Is that a sign I see right there? It is. Boom. A little shortcut into the village. Ooh, Corvette. But that is actually going to be the end of this video, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed. Thanks for watching. I really do appreciate it. Uh, if you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, smash on that thumbs up button, letting me know you guys, uh, in fact, like the video and want to see more. Um, also, feel free to leave a comment. All comments and feedback are always greatly appreciated. Uh, just leave one down in the comment section below. Tell me what you guys think, what you want to see, uh, what you're excited for about this game, or what you've been doing that's really awesome, or just anything in general. Just say what's up. Um, also, if you're free, if you're free. <laughs> also, if you're new to my channel, uh, feel free to subscribe. All you have to do is uh, click the TV. It'll bring you to my channel and then uh, that way whenever I upload a new video you guys will get notified and you'll never miss out on any of the content I post on post here on my channel so uh, that being said next episode we're gonna be doing this uh, horizon bucket list challenge which will be driving the uh, Corvette and then we're gonna head back to the hub check out our barn finds and then do the road trip event so uh, yeah stay tuned don't don't want to miss out on all that cool action so um, I will talk to you guys in the next video. Peace out, guys.